Well, ever wonder what would happen if you combined a 5K and a symphony orchestra? Who hasn't pondered that question, right? Well, for this week's Community Spotlight, Sarah Winkleman was at the Beat Beethoven 5K in Baxter to find out. In an effort to combine the running world with the music world, the Heartland Symphony Orchestra hosted their third annual Beat Beethoven 5K. Helps us reach a new audience, um, besides the people that typically come to a classical music concert. So it's really nice to take those two pieces and put them together. Throughout the course, Beethoven's fifth symphony, performed by the Heartland Symphony Orchestra, was playing in the background. If runners crossed the finish line before the music stopped, they would receive a free ticket to their next concert. For the community to gather together and enjoy high quality classical music is so important. So we're so happy to be here enjoying this fundraiser and bringing the community together for fundraisers like this as well. A select portion of the money raised will be designated to musical outreach in the schools. Being a teacher, I know that it's important for kids to have that experience when they're young and all the way through uh, middle school when they can start learning instruments and enjoying some musical experiences that aren't typically on the radio. The top finishing male and female of the 5K will win the prize Beethoven Bobblehead. I think it's a great idea. I mean, it's a great, I'm so excited to be here and there's so much energy going on right now. An excitement about music that the organizers hope will remain in the Brainerd Lakes area. It just shows you that classical music is still such an integral part of our community. We play some really high caliber music at our orchestra concerts, so it really is a unique experience for our area to have an orchestra like this. In its 41st season, the Heartland Symphony Orchestra has a long-standing tradition of bringing classical music to central Minnesota. And it's just really cool to see the community support that comes along with kids that are just starting orchestra in fifth and sixth grade and then they, are, they bring their families out. A family fun race with a goal of beating Beethoven. For this week's Community Spotlight in Baxter, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. The next concert for the Heartland Symphony Orchestra is this Saturday in Little Falls and Sunday in Brainerd. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.